Welcome back. It is great to have you here on WKYT. It's National Safe Digging Month. That means you need to know what's below before you dig. Just call 811. Tim Vaughn is here to tell us more about it. Thank you so much. This is really important. People really need to make sure that they, t that they do this, that they take this step. That's right. Well, most people think that 811 and call before you dig just relates to the large professional contractor. Mm -hmm. But it's just as important, if not more, for the homeowner when you do those projects. And that's why April is National Safe Digging Month. It's when we start coming out of our cocoons and start doing our projects around the house. And so, so we want to take this month to remind everyone that you need to call and have those utility lines located uh, before you dig. And we'll notify the utility uh, companies around the area, like Columbia Gas. They're very concerned about the safety mm -hmm. of, of people in their community and their customers so they'll send people out that'll locate their lines so even just uh, putting some flowers out something like that uh, well it you don't have to call me for putting flowers out there's an exemption on, on the, in the Kentucky law and you mm -hmm. can go to our website and get all that information but certainly if you're doing like a deck or a mailbox or trees things like that we're going a little deeper mm -hmm. that, that's when you really need to call so who is required I mean again a homeowner a contractor anybody who's doing that kind of work right and anyone that's digging in the ground at all is required by Kentucky law to notify the utility operators in the area that you're digging and we we have a, a membership base of those utilities contractors or uh, utility companies that will notify when uh, you got to call us two days in advance and, and uh, we'll notify them and they'll okay, come out so and locate two it. days in advance what about the price it's free it's absolutely free to do uh, and they'll, they'll use a color coding system when they come out for instance uh, Columbia will mark their facilities in yellow which mm -hmm. stands for gas worldwide not just in Kentucky but worldwide uh, and uh, water is blue Kentucky American will, will locate their, their stuff in blue uh, but it's free service uh, Really, no reason not to take no, advantage no, no of it. No reason not to use it. That's yeah. exactly right. Mm -hmm. How do they know what's under the ground there, right, in those locations? Well, they they use uh, electronic equipment to locate it. Plus, they have their maps and their their system diagrams and stuff that they'll use. But they'll they'll hook onto it and be able to locate it with equipment. What if you don't do this? If somebody has not heard about this and they don't do it, and they hit something, are homeowners responsible? Yes, they are. And if you hit a gas line, the Public Service Commission is now issuing penalties and citations for people who violate and not call 811 and hit a gas line. So not only are you responsible for repairing what you broke, but you could also have to pay a fine for breaking the law. Plus, if you damage something else, you, yeah. you're responsible so for that, too. So really serious. It, it definitely is. All right, so call 811, or you can uh, go to the website, Kentucky811.org. That's right? correct. Yeah, There's a lot of information there that will help you out. Very good.